Today I'm very pleased to make two significant announcements. Firstly, we have brought forward $40 million of that $300 million in planning. Uh, that will be available right now uh, to make sure that the planning work is done. The balance of the money will be delivered in the very first budget of our government as we outlined. But the bring forward of that money means that planning work doesn't have to wait until the beginning of the new financial year. The second announcement today beyond the bring forward of that $40 million is uh, the Melbourne Metro Rail Authority. This is going to be the dedicated focus, the expertise, the hard work that is necessary to make this very big project the reality that Victorians want it to be. This is effectively a second city loop. Uh, this is five brand new stations. Uh, it's 20,000 extra passenger movements in the morning peak and the afternoon peak. It's a train system and a public transport system in many respects where no timetable is needed. This is about making sure that the world's most livable city has a 21st century public transport system. It is a nine to $11 billion uh, project. That's the numbers that Infrastructure Australia have put on it. It remains Infrastructure Australia's number one infrastructure priority for our state. Uh, it is three and a half thousand jobs. It is a very significant undertaking. It's the biggest investment, the biggest transformation of our public transport system since the original city loop was constructed in the early 80s. What we're announcing today is the bringing forward of $40 million of our $300 million commitment to this project to undertake the detailed planning work that is just so vital to make sure this project is delivered within the timeframes that we need it to be. So we're establishing the Melbourne Metro Authority. That authority will oversee the finalisation of the business case. There is work to be done to refresh that business case and make sure that alongside of that, the detailed planning work is done, the engineering work is done, the site assessment's done, and also importantly too, the community consultation is undertaken on the finalisation of the, uh, the route and the design. That is a big job and that's why we don't want to waste one single moment in getting this project underway.